all right yo what is going on everybody as you can see guys we're back on the camera for you guys today today i'm gonna be doing a little bit of a different video for you guys today i'm gonna be doing like a tutorial video uh because uh, i think this is actually like a really good thing that a lot of people can use uh if you guys stream on your computer and if you guys have a webcam and everything like that so I'm going to be showing you guys how you can turn your camera from this into looking like this. As you guys can see, guys, it's a lot more high. It looks it looks a lot more high quality. We got the, like the blurred background and everything like that. And we have like uh, just me as like the center focus like of the camera and stuff like that. So basically, guys, I'm going to be showing you guys how you can do this. It's pretty easy. If you guys have a PC, you guys do have to have a PC for this. So if you guys don't have a PC, then I'm sorry. But this is only for PC. So uh, let's just get straight into it, guys. Get straight into the video. Let's go. Okay, so what you're going to be doing, guys, you're, you're going to be opening up your browser, whatever browser you use and then you, this is what you're going to be typing in the thing guys you're going to be typing nvidia uh what's it called nvidia broadcast and so as you see it'll pop up right there and you guys do have to have a nvidia graphics card as well uh to actually make this like work so make sure you guys have everything all the requirements you guys have to have to have a pc a camera and a nvidia graphics card so you're gonna you're gonna click the first link that pops up nvidia broadcast is out now so as you can see it's loading up right now so as you can see it's like the it, it, it kind of gives like a little in-depth tutorial of what the thing actually is so this so how you download it is what i typed in is nvidia broadcast download i'll leave a link in the description if you guys want to download this yourself so uh, as you guys can see you guys are just click, gonna click download now it'll download and then this is what's going to pop up once you're done with the download. It's going to be a NVIDIA broadcast type little thing. And it's going to have your microphone, your speakers, and your camera. We're going to be focusing on the camera today, guys. Maybe in another episode or something like that, we can actually do like the microphone and everything like that. I don't know why my OBS just closed out right there. But so as you guys can see, as we have the NVIDIA broadcast up right here. So as you can see, with the background effects, we do have a bunch of background effects. We have background blur, which we can do, which is the blur in the background. You guys can see right here, I just enabled it. And now another thing we have is background replacement. So you can actually replace your background with like a different image or something like that. So if I turn it on, you can see it kind of has like a green screen effect, but it's it's okay. It's still in beta, but um, it's not that bad to be honest. But so that's one of them. We also have, also have just a background removal if you guys want to try to do a green screen or something like that. But as you can see, it doesn't really work as well. So you got to, I think after the beta, it's still in beta, it'll get a little bit better. And then, and then uh, this is actually a really cool one. This one is called auto frame. So if you zoom in like this in my face and I move, the camera literally moves with me. That's actually, that's freaking insane. That's actually kind of dope. We're going to be, so what we're going to be doing guys, we're going to be doing the background blur today. So what you guys have to do is you're going to click the background blur. You're going to turn that all the way up because I feel like it looks best when it's all the way up. Let me see what it looks like, like 50% or something like that. I mean, 50% is not bad, but I feel like hundred percent looks the best. So you're going to put that thing all the way up and then it's going to look like this. Uh, the face cam, as you can see, is what I look like. And then um, to actually get the contrast and everything like that, so you guys can see how it's kind of like plain right now. It's not really like it doesn't have a lot of color and stuff like that. So what you're going to have to do is you're going to actually go into your OBS settings. You guys can see I'm actually in my OBS right now. The plus button right in the bottom, you're going to click game capture. And then what you're going to do is you're going to add a game capture and you're going to add a specific window. Then you're going to add NVIDIA broadcast. Then it will pop up right away as the actual camera it won't show anything around it will just show the camera which is actually kind of sick so once you do that the camera will pop up get your uh, face cam overlay and stuff like that put it in there and then from here guys you're gonna have to uh adjust kind of like your color settings in obs so you're gonna go to your face cam you're gonna go to filters as you see this is what i look like right now you're gonna go to color correction so this is what it looks like before guys and then this is what it looks like after a lot more depth and field uh, a little bit more like i don't know kind of like darker colors and stuff like that kind of looks like that so if you guys do want to paste or copy these um what's it called copy these face cam settings that i have this is what it looks like it's 0, 0.00 for the gamma Con contrast is 0. Uh, 20. we got brightness is zero don't really need to make it any brighter unless your room is a little bit darker and then we have saturation was a negative 0. 0.12 and then we have the uh, hue shift zero and then opacity is 100 and then basically guys that's really it i'll show you guys what it looks like guys in full screen so let's do that right now there you go guys this is what the camera looks like guys it looks a lot better than just the default settings if you guys uh want to see what the default settings look like so this is what it looks like with all the filters and everything on and then this is what it looks like with everything off so we got that off and then we have the filter which is over here we had turned that all the way off so color corrections like that it looks it's, it looks pretty plain then you put the color correction back on it looks pretty good with the depth and field then you turn on the background effect and it looks really nice i think it looks really nice guys uh make sure you guys try this out for yourself link me in the description if you guys want to try the nvidia broadcast i think it's really cool but i hope you guys enjoyed this video if you guys did make sure you give a like subscribe if you're new turn on that post notification post a quick tutorial video if you guys if you guys want to kind of up your I don't know kind of like up your what's it called your webcam quality as you can say because you guys see it looks a lot better than like just the default setting so hope you guys enjoyed this video if you guys didn't make sure to give it a like subscribe if you're new turn on that post notification bell and i'll see you guys next one guys peace out, everybody